sure to like, share, and subscribe. <laughs> That's awesome. I could cut this out and edit it. No! It has to stay. Hey, hey welcome to the Sean Wayne. <laughs> What's up? Now. Welcome, video number four. I'm going to set this down. Oh, God. Whoops. What's okay. that Evo? I think I'm Wolfus. <laughs> welcome to video number four. Um, everything arrived today. We got the tires, we got the lift kit. Uh, he stopped by, he got us some flex tubing that stretches. <laughs> and uh, we're gonna stick all this on tonight. And hopefully we won't be here till 12 o'clock. Did you lose the other clamp already? Jesus. <laughs> we're gonna be here till 12 o'clock. <laughs> hey. I'm here with Dylan and Austin. And one clamp. One clamp. So let's get started. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> Don't be weird, bro. Our straight raise billet three inch lift kit, courtesy of Jonathan, again, at Coleman Artery Builders. We're we'll going to be putting these on. You look weird holding that trap line. Shut up. <laughs> trying to hold her steady and I can't with you moving around what? he said don't move <laughs> can you explain what that is please it's the same as the other two okay I that was the real one the other two is the front one I sure hope so, because that's where it's going to be. Totally like this. Unless it's going to twist the top pad. So makes sense. Here's our uh, lift kit. Our new hardware. New studs and new bolts put in it. So you don't have to remove the studs out of the top hat and replace them in this to make these work. They just bolt right on. Work. Think of it as a commercial doing. <laughs> there you go. Huh? There you go. Do I know? Huh? Okay. Dude, all this rubber <laughs> been chewing up. <laughs> <laughs> <Dang>. <laughs> All right, here's the new tires that Jonathan has provided us with. I put a screenshot in the video that y'all seen uh, last video. But here is the new tires. They are meaty, brand new. And they've got a Komodo Dragon on the side and they're on the stock wheels. And we're about to put them on to see if they're gonna how they're gonna do, if they're gonna fit. This is just stock. We haven't done anything to the car yet. We haven't, yeah, the suspension. We haven't lifted it or nothing. All right, so the new tires are a bit too meaty and we're gonna see if it's gonna change anything in order, like when we do the lift, if we're not gonna be rubbing and touching anything. So, man. <laughs> That sounded so weird. <laughs> <laughs> so he's jacking the car up, which would be the equivalent of what, three inches to it's lift already, it? Well, I guess it's already kind of. Yeah. Probably about right there. Lord have mercy. Alright, we'll be alright. Let's just work on the tire set. Nothing too dark in here. You need a lot? Where's your lot? There we go. I got it. Oh, that's not bad. Not bad? Not bad? God, dude, this thing is going to look so dope. Oh my gosh. That is insane. We're still going to have to trim that out. That's okay. We can do it. 
And that uh, we're going to take flat. this other piece off of there, and then we'll trim this, and then we'll trim some of that there. Okay. Let's get the lift on. We know how much really we got to trim. No good clearance right there. Good deal. I think the three wire and the two washer things going to work good. That feels solid. We don't feel like it's rocking on the stove no more. And what he's saying about the washers is, um, we got the one-inch spacers, and we explained this in other videos. The uh, the spacers. I think we can wrap it stop. I'd rather not. Oh, <laughs> no, <I'd say. laughs> Take it for a spin. <laughs> the spacers, or yeah, the spacers that we got, the lug sticks out, and so does the um, like you can, as you can see right here, the nut. the nut and everything sticks out. Instead of grinding it down and just like doing a bunch of ton of work, he bought some spacers to put on here, and then it spacers brings the yeah, spacers. yeah. Spacers on washers on the spacers, it brings the wheel out so it doesn't rub against these, so we can tighten it down. Make and... sure we tighten the spacers, so that's just barely done. Okay. So I guess we're gonna get to yeah. work. <laughs> uh, this is the stock front bumper. Basically what we're gonna do is we're gonna put the bumper on, but I think we're gonna have to trim this piece around 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 this area. I think we're gonna have to trim. We may not have to, depending on the lift. Um, we are gonna trim this middle piece out it, it, to some extent because we do we did reinforce the bumper because we know how bad the core supports are around here. <laughs> Especially with the go-kart. So we've reinforced this. Right here, it's pretty solid. And then we're putting a skid plate under it. And we want to be able to see all this. So we're going to trim the bumper up so that we can see all this. And the skid plate too. All right, now we're checking the back to make sure everything fits. Everything works and all that good stuff. Huh? I'm sweating on this one. <laughs> All right, so what he's talking about is that you can see right here, the tire is actually touching, and that's what we were talking about cutting. And that way we could actually modify. run the tire, or modify, yeah. All right, now we're just seeing if the uh, front tire is going to fit without a spacer. Come on. It is hitting right there. I doubt body or the body? Way it's not bad. Hey, well, it might not even be hitting me. If it's not, it's close. Here, here. Oh, you can't. Come on to. No. That's how close that is to the control. Oh, yeah. We'll, we'll just beat that in. The tire rolls a little bit. I mean, that's okay. Yeah, it's no big deal. Got a lot of meat on there. Uh, it does catch this a little bit, I think. Mm, no, you're no. good. You're good. You good up front? Yeah, ain't nothing up here. <laughs> so basically right now what we're gonna do is take apart the, take off the front struts. So we can put the lift kit in. He gets an air impact and I get a quarter inch ratchet. I'm experienced. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta see one of them. This is sketchy with that brake line. That's all right. <laughs> and this brake line. All right, this is uh, the front done on the driver's side and the passenger side's done too. I was just kind of giving y'all an example, or this is kind of what it looks like right now. Clearance, that's for sure. And it'll, 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 be, it'll be pretty good with the bumper on here too. It's not gonna scrub. Uh, Dylan's gonna be mad. Why? <laughs> and then here's the other side. I get the camera set up. And then there you go, there's the other side. Put LEDs in. I don't know if you can see them. You probably can't. There's LEDs inside. We got the back loosened and ready to come off. Uh, both sides. One of the bolts is stuck on the other side. But this is what we're working on now. We're just going to go ahead and give you an update. Like we said, what we're doing is uh, basically we're going to put a spacer and then we're going to put the washers on. To bring that out a little bit so it don't touch the uh, lug nuts on the inside. And we're going to put another spacer on, put more washers, and then put the wheel on.
hopefully it's going to be okay. But this is like what we got to do until we get two inch spacers to space it out to put the wheels on. And then there's the other two wheels that's going on the back. Meaty and brand new. It's going to be awesome. Welcome back! Day two to uh, this. Um, <laughs> lift. <laughs> this lift. So we got the front lifted. Dylan's working on the spacers to the back trailing arm. And we got the man of the hour. He's here. The guy that sponsored this whole deal. He flew from Jamaica. Yeah, I'm Meet Jonathan. Hey, guys, what's up? <laughs> Where, what did you do? I wonder if we can just leave this sway bar out of here. Yeah, we don't need a rear sway bar. Yeah, it drops it. So when you put the box up in here and it lowers this whole shock, you lower this down so it gets your angle back right. So it's not pulling this forward when you bolt it back up. Hey, Dylan. All right. Wish us luck. We're about to go drive this. Jonathan, can we just build a rally Evo now? Yes. Down. You done messed up. You got it. All right, we're fixing to pull this thing out and see about driving it. The lift is on. As you can see, the front and rear tires. Uh, we got a sponsored sticker. Hey, do you think you could get a uh, big hood sticker made? Dude, this is two days. I can uh, I can hit them up first thing in the morning. And if you, see if, they're willing if to. you, I was gonna pull some measurements and do get the making cars great again, like all the way across. Yeah. Because if you get a big fat hood sticker, we'll stick it on there. That'd be cool. If not, I mean, we can get a like a window banner to go across here. Yeah. Just made for. Spirit shop or something. Yeah, check it out. I'll see. I'll, I'll hit them up in the morning. See how busy they are. Okay. You see what they say. That would be cool. Got the we've got the bumper cut and it looks so good it looks like a sort of Baja we've got the reinforced part of it here and then I cut the bottom out so it goes around the fog lights and comes over the reinforced part which I love it's so amazing I freaking love this I'm so proud of this 
It looks really good, I like it. All right, this is uh, the snorkel so far. Uh, Dylan and Jonathan are doing the alignment. That's why Dylan's laying on the ground. Taking a nap. Taking a nap. This is Austin. <laughs> He's uh, tightening up the fender right now. We got the snorkel running through the fender and drying. That's why there's tape on it. And it should be functional after we, oh dude. After you step all over a Burger King bag. Uh, I thought the fender bolts were in this. I don't think they are. No, you, you're the one that took them off. I know, I laid them up there on that thing. You liar. Yeah. Are these them? I don't know. Yeah. All right, so we have the fender fully intact. With the PVC pipe is drying for the uh, snorkel. We're fixing to clamp it down right here. And this is all intact. The front bumper's intact. It's not moving. And it looks so good. So proud of that bumper. It looks so good. This is just a quick update. Just said it again. <laughs> All right, so now we're done. Finally, everything's done. The lift's done. The strut. Struts are done, or strut mounts are done. The tires are on. The spacers are on. Everything is done. Look at that. It is ready to ride. We're gonna drive it down the road just to test it. Make sure everything drives good. God, look at that old video. <laughs> the snorkel's done. The hood is shut. Ish. Oh, we can do that tomorrow. Tomorrow's like, put the stickers on it. Cosmetics. You still gotta edit this video or not? What the hell was that? Oh no, I ain't edited it. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. The video's gonna be a little late. <laughs> a little like, I don't know, military little things. Like Buddha. <laughs> yeah. That was up there until the shine knocked it off. <laughs> I did not. <laughs> Uh, we're gonna drive it make sure everything's good but other than that we shall see you guys tomorrow in the next vlog subscribe peace